So it's Saturday here in the Midwest. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Wednesday is the 4th of July. Is it, okay, does that make it 4th of July weekend this weekend or next or weekend? Or after. I'm not sure. It's I'm, like I celebrate my birthday before and after, so that kind of makes... Yeah, I you did too. it's both. Yeah, Or yeah. like the whole month. You guys should see the stuff she's been pulling. <laughs> birthday privileges whatever but anyway True. what i'm saying though is if you hear fireworks during this video you'll know what it is mm -hmm. actually it is that time of year where you got to question it sometimes we you, play you, a game sometimes sometimes you hear it in the in the distance and you go was that fireworks or a nine millimeter or sometimes you hear a huge boom and you think hmm was that a Mosin-Nagant? Yeah, seriously, seriously. Some of them are just insane. You guys know what I'm talking about. Yep. All right. But yeah, 4th of July coming up. It's hot out. Mm -hmm. And it's also the worst time of year for flashlight testing. <laughs> it is. So, yeah, it gets dark at pretty much 10 o'clock. We can't go out until 10. I know. It's, it's like way past our bedtime. So that's why we're drinking some coffee. Some coffee. I've got my soda. Dr. Pepper here. Mm -hmm. Actually, this would be good for reference. Blanche. She's got Blanche. <laughs> yeah, worst time of the year for flashlight testing, and it's very hot. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say we're gonna we're gonna do a little bit of testing near our house. Yes. Um, and we're just gonna go minimal carry. I'm I'm just wearing gym shorts and a t-shirt. Frankie's going minimal. Uh, uh, I'm not gonna wear any clothes. Okay. <laughs> and what was I gonna? Oh, I'm just gonna go with the uh, cold steel spike. Yeah, there you go. I got this out after uh, not having carried it for a while. And actually, there's the spike. It is a good knife. It's got a little bit of corrosion I need to take mm -hmm. care of. But it's got this... Um, Reflector. Reflective paracord. Anyway, mm -hmm. let's get to the flashlight. We've got our second through night. Yes. And our first dedicated thrower. Yeah. And we both love it. It catapults. Frankie. What? That's true. It gives it away. The name gives it away. Comes in this box. You're already looking at it. I know. I guess we should just say. I was looking at it. Catapult V6. I love the name. Mm -hmm. I love the name. Yeah. Here it is. Um, because yeah, you wait all day. You get a nap. <laughs> you know you're gonna go out later to to uh, do flashlight testing. Mm -hmm. Why wait till the last minute to charge it? Oh yeah. Right. I forgot. Because you're a genius. <sighs> so it's doing a little bit of charging before we go out. Mm -hmm. Because I forgot. Well, we've been using it around the house. I know. It is really fun. Okay, but like we need it. to get it out distance. Yes. Real distance. Because this Test thing will it. throw. Let's uh, talk about some specs. Yeah, it's okay. called the Catapult V6. Frankie, $75. So you can see here, it's an aluminum-bodied flashlight. It's uh, 6061 T6 heat-treated aluminum. <laughs> you yeah. just love saying it. Yeah, it, it uh, comes apart in two pieces. We're not going to do it now because we're going to go ahead and get every bit of charge in there. Mm -hmm. But inside here is one big old chunky 26650 battery mm -hmm. that is included. Yeah, and as you can see, you can charge it. It's USB charging. Yeah, and which is so really awesome. I love it that that's like the new feature of the whole. New flashlights, flashlights are doing yeah. this. Yeah, it's very common these days, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but a little uh, rubber cap over there. Perfect. Uh, power bank. You could charge this anywhere. Yep. I guess we didn't write the weight down or anything like that. Eh, it's, it's kind of heavy. It, it's a little chunky. How about that? Yeah. 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 He's short and chunky. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So it's got. I want to say it's five modes. Yeah. If you count them all. Everybody wants to know the brightest, uh, brightest amount of lumens this thing has. Okay. Seventeen hundred. Seventeen hundred. Well, that's nothing. Mhm. Mm In today's world of flashlights, that's nothing. It is. Well, isn't. yes, it is because this is a thrower. We're gonna yes. show you. We're gonna show you why. Yes. What it means. This stands out uniquely if you mm -hmm. especially if you don't know what a thrower type flashlight is we'll show you why it gets its name catapult it's kind of crazy okay but 1700 lumens that it spotlights yeah that's on the turbo mode brightest super turbo which lasts 150 minutes okay and then the high mode mm -hmm. is 950 lumens yes still pretty dang bright 165 minutes that's a long time too yeah although the distance between those two yeah, why not just go turbo? Right, yeah. Let's do go turbo mode. I'm not exactly everything. sure if those specs are correct, but I don't know. anyway. Anyways. Medium is 180 lumens. You can go nine, nine hours. hours. Yep. That's and then a low, long time. Low is 22. You could use low for most stuff, especially up close. Mm -hmm. um, you can use that for 62 whole hours. That's then crazy. you've got Firefly, which is that tiny little um, half, a, in this case, half a lumen, mm -hmm. which if you're inside a dark house at night, it's enough. It's enough yeah. for a lot of stuff. 41 days. Think Talking, about that. That's crazy just to leave a flashlight on for 41 days. We're thinking like emergency situation, mm -hmm. um, zombie, SHTF type stuff. All yeah. right. Yeah. 
Um, then it's got the strobe, di sorry, it's got disco mode. Yeah, jeez. It's got disco mode. Disco mode for 180 minutes. That's a long time partying. Pumping, mm -hmm. okay, out 1,200 lumens. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, okay, so let's talk about the highest performance numbers. 1,700 lumens that it throws. It's going to throw that light in a spotlight. Throw that light. 750 meters. 750 meters. Okay, what's that in yards? Speaking of firearms, and we're mm -hmm. talking, you know, a lot of guys will know yards. Yeah. Okay, that's 820 yards. That's 2,460 feet. That's fast math. It's really fast Actually, math. Actually, she did just I did that, do guys. it really yeah. fast. <laughs> yeah. um, but anyway, 820 yards. That's crazy. You guys ever been out to a, um, a military shooting range? Mm -hmm. A lot of times they'll have 1,000 yards. We've seen those. Uh, we've yeah. not shot 1,000 yards, but we've, you know. We did 600, wasn't it? Yeah, we've done 600. It's a huge distance, That's okay? That's a really long ways. And this thing's going to range that far? That's insane. And look at it. Look, look. Here. Frankie, you want to stand it up right next to that? It's like the same size. Look at this. It's crazy. All right. Yeah, so we're going to go check it out at night um, in a spot nearby our house. Mm -hmm. Ugh, it's still really hot out. <laughs> yeah. Did we Did we get the blue? No, not yet. It would turn blue if it was fully charged. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. I'm just going to say real quick, too. Waterproof, two meters. We're so not, you can throw it in a puddle if you want to. We're not going to test that. No, I'm not going to throw it. And impact resistant to 1.5 meters. We're not going to. No, not gonna I'm not going to throw it either. It's too nice. I no. love it. Just, I like it a lot. Guys, don't drop it. I just love the size of it. It is just oh, you know, so cool. Actually, it does come with a lanyard. Oh, it does? Shoot. To, oh, help, us, I put it to on? help us not drop it, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Frankie doesn't like her phone. Okay, here we go. The through night lanyard that is included. Look at that it, skill. Nice. That was real quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It it does come with a key ring there, but Frankie skipped it. She's going. I went murdered out, Joe. Well, and she's going tactical. Yeah. That's, uh, that's It'd be too be much clankety clank. Too much noise, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Well, and it does come with extra seals and an extra cover for some, the USB port. Some garbage port. that hopefully you'll never have to use. Whatever. Okay. All right, let's get out there. Okay. Okay, Frankie and I are on location at our nearby trail. Mm-hmm. I've actually got my backup light here, the Through Night Archer 2A V3. Nice, okay. I'm looking at the ground. I've got my... Um, firefly mode. Firefly mode. Let me get closer. Now you can see it. Frankie, show yours. That's your firefly? Yeah. She's holding it way up here, guys. Here, I'll go to low. There. Look at her firefly compared to this one. Wow. Yeah, Just crazy. look at that. That lasts 40 some days. That is insane. Frankie, say hey. Hey. All right, we're going to show you what this exact spot looks like in the daytime, where I'm standing and where we're facing exactly, okay? You can see that it's an urban trail goes straight all the way down there. Right to the bank we make her. This path is pretty well pitch dark, even though nearby it's kind of an industrial area. In fact, there's some parties going on. I know. Quite the raver. Yeah. Alright, go ahead with your catapult V6. Okay, what are we looking at here? You can see Frankie's silhouette. On high mode. You're on high? Yeah. Actually this is good. I'm behind you I can see exactly what you're doing. Oh it actually does spill quite a bit more than I thought. Mm -hmm. So there's light all around you. Yeah, really. Aim it out there. Now, that's down the trail. Look how far down the trail you can see in the high mode, okay? Yeah. And actually, this is great. There's... Uh, the illumination around you is, is great. Yeah, it's for a, really wide. For a dedicated spotlight, yeah. Okay, high mode. Let's take a look at this guy. She's just going to pan around a little bit in and around the trail. Everything everything we're shining the light on is pitch black right now, otherwise. Yeah, it's crazy. Okay. Let's switch to uh, turbo. Oh my god. <laughs> That's insane. Now, yeah, do do those trees to the right up there further down and up higher. Car went past. Wow. It like makes it like daylight down there. Yeah. Alright, let's go for a walk. Okay. I gotta say, the only thing about this is that it is getting kind of hot. Yeah, well it's a warm day. Yeah, it's getting warm. 
Um, guys, you haven't seen a lot of the footage. We've been messing around with it off camera before we started filming. Okay, so this is still turbo. Which is okay, keep it steady. Okay. Well, it's hard to walk and keep it steady. All right. Is this turbo right now? Yeah, this is turbo. Alright. Aim it to the left, up in those trees. Further away. This thing is nuts. Yeah, it really is. Again, I can't emphasize this enough. The camera does not do this justice. Alright. This thing is crazy. Your average flashlight just cannot do this. I'm just amazed with how wide it goes. Go ahead and turn yours off. I'm going to show you real quick what. This is 500 lumens right here. Okay? It's not reaching anything near what we're talking about. Alright? This is a bright light. But it just can't, it just doesn't have the capabilities. Okay, go with yours. That's high. Let me see. Where are you at? Right here. That's Firefly? Yeah. Right in front of you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Light up the trail. Okay. Another car going by. Well, I was going to just go through the different regular ones. Okay, so this is low. Yep. Medium. Yep. High. So there's high again. Look how far it shoots down there. And turbo. Double click. Oh, uh, strobe. So that was a quadruple click. Yeah. There's turbo. Okay, keep it steady down the trail. That's nuts. It really is. It's, that's really far away. I'm trying to look through the viewfinder here. Mm -hmm. At the same time, walk and look ahead of it with my eyes. You can see much more with your eyes. You just can. Well, and we're not even in like the tree section very much, so it will be even brighter in there, I bet you. True, it'll be darker in there. The light itself is starting to get pretty warm. Mm -hmm. We've been using it a lot, but it is 90, so take that into account. Well, I guess like really when you were using this in the winter time, it'd be nice because it'd be like a little hand warmer. <laughs> true, true. Wow. I'm going to I'm going to burn your hair if I aim it at your head. Look at this. That is a true spotlight. Wait. There. 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 <laughs> That's stupid. You're stupid. You're stupid. It is getting hot though. Yeah. There's all next to us. Here's behind us. There's a road back there. You can see a car in the distance. Wow. Yeah, it's getting hot. <laughs> okay, I told you. <laughs> yep. All right, Frankie's got the 500 lumens Archer, the different light. Aim it down the trail. It's just, I'm not, you know. It's just not the same. No, it's not. Okay, I'm gonna go turbo I here. This was good too. Look at that. That's crazy. You guys can see this hill here. I'm not so sure. I mean, this has got the capabilities of a tactical flashlight, as in the brightness. Like, that will blind somebody if you aim it right at them. But getting through all the different modes is probably too confusing on this light to be a tactical light. You just couldn't, you couldn't do it quick enough. But as an emergency or search party or, you know, having your vehicle, especially if you live out in the distance, out in the woods somewhere, mm -hmm. all kinds of uh, applications for this light. I guess, look at how much it lights up everything. I'm, I'm really just surprised at the spill. Yeah. All around us. Well, because look at how much it is. It's more than this little flashlight was doing. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wow. All right, we climbed up this little hill here. This is this industrial park near us. 
All right, this is just the lights on the buildings in the parking lot. Look, they have a basketball hoop. That's cool. Where? Are we? Oh, yeah. Look at how insane this thing is. I don't know if it's coming through for you guys, but the building way down there Ooh, is being lit I like up. How you, like the reflection on the, the uh, signs. Yeah. Look at how bright that is. Look at this. Wow. A mini thrower. But don't get confused by the name. <laughs> <laughs> it is an absolute thrower. Yeah, it's Saturday night in Indy. All the hot rods are out. This thing is nuts. Yeah. And yes, it does get hot. It does get it's hot. Like a Batman spotlight. Yep. Disco There's mode. Disco. You have to get over to that party for that, that light. Yeah, they're going crazy over there. Thankfully, it's far enough away from our house. We can't hear it. Oh, look at it on those lights. That looks crazy. Yeah. Oh, sorry for your... Uh, this is also seizure mode. Wow. Yeah, it's getting hot for sure. Yeah. All right, we're each on low just to walk back to the car. I just want to say, um, it does get hot, okay? Mm -hmm. It does. It gets really warm. In this temperature especially, but... I will say, as soon as I turn it on low or turn it off, it cools quickly. Yeah. It's cooling quickly. But like I said, it would be kind of a nice little hand warmer if you're out, like, doing searches. That would be a benefit. It would be a nice feature. In the winter. Uh-huh. All right, we're faced the opposite direction, straight down a street there that goes, shoot, I don't know, 2,000 yards? It's pretty far down there. There's turbo mode. And look, you can get the reflection on the stop sign down there. There's a stop sign way down there. That's that it, crazy. This is reflecting off of. You guys see that? Well, and even look on like the mile per hour sign. Yeah. That's crazy. Wow. Impressive. Very impressive. That's bright. You could drive with this. Yeah, you really could. Just <laughs> hanging your hand down a window <laughs> in a dark country road if your headlights were out. You could drive with this thing. Yeah, that's crazy. Or it's a engine. nice color white too. Yeah. So that's the Through Night Catapult V6. Awesome flashlight. Yeah, get one today. We're saying skip that next pocket knife. Skip that next multi-tool. Skip that next tank of I gas. I say that. No, don't do that. You <laughs> can have Top Ramen for top, a week. Top Ramen, okay. They will pay, it will pay for it. Get yourself a badass flashlight. Mm -hmm. get this yourself, thing is so sweet. Get yourself a flashlight that you can throw in your glove box uh, for emergency situations, that kind of thing. Or just one you don't even no, need. No, you just want this around the house. You for don't fun. want to put it in your glove compartment. For fun, to spy on your neighbors, okay? That's yeah. just creepy now. All right. Anyway, it's awesome. <laughs> Check it out for yourselves and uh, give us some feedback. Yep. Thanks a lot for joining us. Bye. If we can get a focus here, there is a moth. <laughs> there is a uh, there's a stop sign way down at the end of this street, and we can moth, see. Stop going in the light. <laughs> we can see the light, uh, the reflection off the the moth that's screwing me up. Let's walk a little bit. Okay. Okay, Frankie. Shit. You know how to, you just pull it. <laughs> yeah, I, sorry, okay, let's do it again.